Grok tours is now a thing. You can just say to Grok, show me around the city and that can integrate into full self-driving um, or maybe that's coming or not yet. You can just imagine what a AI enabled car is actually going to look like. I have some personal Tesla updates, at least one over here, the new Model Y. I've tried the full self-driving, which is you still have to pay attention to the road. And I've been caught out a couple of times. I've been using it and I've like tried to like send a sneaky text and it like beeps at you, says pay attention, which is which is good while that's figuring out the kinks. But it's been really good. What I found interesting was it's got a mode, it's got different modes of how conservative you want it to be. So you can be on the very conservative mode of like be careful, drive like grandma, up to the mode that they call hurry. And so I've got it on hurry mode at the moment. And one interesting thing that I tried to do the other day was when turning left the lights you know the lights go green and in hurry mode it decides to try and scoot out and turn left before the oncoming traffic goes and i'm like what the f are you doing elon or Tes tesla <laughs> i've taken control of the wheel and i'm kind of like half in the intersection people are like what are you doing so i end up just going straight instead but getting very close i would say and the idea of having this fully integrated with a model like rock comes with probably some concerns but also you can imagine how powerful it would be just once it's got access to all the cameras and knows what you're doing you can ask it insights about what you're seeing on the road i just think that's really cool